Hi everyone and welcome back to lesson number 11. My name is Michael Geddes and today I'm going to teach you your first piece based around the major scale. So it's really important that at this point you know how to play the major scale backwards and forwards from low do to high do and you know the name of each one of those notes as well. So if that isn't the case, go back and review lesson number 10, go through those exercises and be sure you know the major scale well before continuing with this lesson. The method I'm going to use today is a world-renowned teaching method that I was certified in in 1998 that I've uh, modified through the years to make it a little bit more universal, I feel. The process involves learning and memorizing pieces by ear before introducing the more complicated aspect of reading music, which I will be introducing in upcoming videos, by the way. So in order to be successful at learning your first piece, the first thing you need to do is make sure your guitar is tuned. And second of all, follow my directions very carefully and very slowly. And if you can do that, by the end of this video, you'll know how to play by memory, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Then I want you to stop the video and play it and go over it three or four more times today, practice it tomorrow and the next day and the next day. If you wait, the memorization process will probably go out the window and you'll have to come back and, and go through this again. So get this one memorized under your fingers and then the next one I teach you will be easier because you've, you've done well with Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Each song becomes a little more difficult, a little more challenging, but if you do well with the song before it, the next one becomes a little bit easier. So let's learn Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. So the first idea of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star is going to be part of the A theme of the song. We'll talk more about A theme, B theme, and so on in just a little bit. But the first idea, and I'm going to teach these to you in little ideas, okay, or riffs. We're going to call them ideas. So here's the first idea. You're going to take your third finger and put it on the note sol or second string, third fret. But you're going to start the idea by playing on the third string and I'm coming up here to play with this hand so you can see what both hands are doing but you'll be keeping your pick down by the bridge as you would normally play so here's the first idea but I'm going to start on the third string right here but I'm keeping my finger placed on the third fret second string and here's the idea Okay, I'm going to do it again. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Here we go again. Good. Pause the video and do that four times. Here's the next idea. You're going to put your first finger, second string, first fret. Fa, fa, mi, mi, re, re, do. One more time. Fa, fa, mi, mi, re, re, do. And that's the second idea. Pause the video and play that four times. So now we're going to add both of those ideas together. So starting from the beginning. Second idea. time. Pause the video and practice that four times. If you have problems with that, go back and review the first idea and the second idea again. So now you've learned the A theme. So themes are like a paragraph in a story. So that was the first part or the A theme of Twinkle Twinkle. Now I'm going to show you this, the B theme of Twinkle Twinkle. I usually don't teach this until the second lesson, especially for younger children. But I'm sure if you're older and if, or if you have musical experience, this is, you, know, you can add this very quickly. So the B theme, you're going to start on Sol, right on Sol this time. Sol, Sol, Fa, Fa, Mi, Mi, Re. And repeat that idea. Okay, 
so you can stop the video and go through that four times. So once you have the B theme down, you can add the A theme and the B theme together. And that would be or sound like this. Here's the B theme now. then guess what? It's real easy to end. You're going to go back to the A theme and complete the song playing the A theme. And congratulations, you've just learned Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. So just for practice sake, now let's go through the entire song one more time. Nice and slow. Don't start speeding this song up. Keep the integrity of the song as if you were singing it to a first grade class, so to speak. Here we go. So what I want you to do is to stop the video, play that through a few more times, and maybe a few more times later in the day, practice it tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And congratulations, once again, you've just learned your first piece, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Our next piece is Lightly Row. So I'm going to end this lesson with the next song we're going to learn, which is called Lightly Row, and I'm going to go through that now. Here's the A theme, and you can be listening to this over and over again. The more you listen to this, the easier it will be for me to teach it to you in the next lesson. A theme. B theme. Second part of the A theme ends the song. And I want you to notice one thing when I'm explaining these videos, I bring my fingers down this way so you can see what the finger is doing when it's playing the note. You should be keeping your fingers hovering above the frets like that. So this brings us to the conclusion of lesson, lesson number 11. Um, if you want to go back and listen to that last in the last clip I recorded, Lightly Row, listen to it several times because that would be the, one of the next pieces that I would teach you in a series I would like to do called Learning Pieces by Ear. And it's important if you're going to continue with this that you really listen to the piece you're working on. And so if you do that, it makes it easier for you to learn and for me to teach as well. So in lesson number 12, I'm gonna go back and recap and go over a lot of the really important things that you need to be practicing and thinking about and working on that will help you get the most out of the previous 12 lessons. So I look forward to seeing you at lesson number 12. My name is Michael Geddes. Thanks for being here today.